In my endless quest to learn all things tech, I've come to a modern city devoted to peace. I'm George Takei, and this is Takei's Take, Hiroshima. Hiroshima today, bustling and vibrant. You can't help being impressed. It has re-emerged as a dynamic city. According to the Japan Times, tourism in Hiroshima reached a record high last year. One thing is certain. Contrary to my fears that young people suffer amnesia, it is young people who preserve Hiroshima's legacy. It's hard not to when it's right on your doorstep, as it is at Funairi High School. This wall is the original wall that took the blast, and the angle that you see this wall at is the exact angle that it was pushed to. Here you see all the names of the young students who were killed in that blast. I've come here to meet the drama students who participate in the Hiroshima Peace Memorial Ceremony every year. I know firsthand the power of theater in keeping history alive. I've been involved with theater and storytelling my entire life. It's the best way to keep history alive. In Los Angeles, two filmmakers did just that with a Kickstarter-funded animated film called Hibakusha, the Japanese word for an atomic blast survivor. The stories of that generation are slowly fading away. For the most part, they don't really teach it in schools. That flash, it wiped out everything. My connection is through a personal friend. Kaz, who is the main character of this film, who went through these gruesome events, she has such a way of telling the story that I couldn't escape. So I figured this movie had to be made for her to keep this history alive, for humanity and peace. New technology creates new methods of storytelling. The Hiroshima Archive uses new technology to gather existing data and stories. It merges past and present, creating new ways for people to connect with history. Hiroshima Archive uses Google Earth to pinpoint the exact location of each survivor. Each point on the map represents a person. Each point on the map tells a story.写真がない方のアイコンのデザインを担当しました。吹き出しの中のあのデザインとあとあの文字の細かいところを担当させていただきました。私は広島からちょっと離れた地域で生まれて育ったために学校の授業の中で原爆についてまなぶことはあったんです
I've learned an important lesson in Hiroshima today. Young people now are just as interested in keeping history alive as I ever was. Whether through acting, filmmaking, app making, or journalism, our next generation storytellers preserve Hiroshima's legacy. This is me, 12 years old. How could I say a school where they teach electronics? School where they uh, teach electronics. <laughs>